no other foundation. According to the grace of God, which was given to me, as a wise master builder, I have laid the foundation, and another builds on it. But let each one take heed how he builds on it, for no other foundation can anyone lay than that which is laid, which is Jesus Christ. A foundation is the lowest load-bearing part of a building, typically below ground level or unseen. Foundations are generally broken into two categories, shallow foundations and deep foundations. Jesus is our load bearer, for in him everything holds together and the kingdom rests upon his shoulder. Every living person is given the opportunity to build his life on the earthly, the shallow, or the heavenly, deep, permanent. We must choose to build our lives on the temporary or the eternal. It is our decision whether we want eternal life or eternal death. Jesus Christ is eternal life. Jesus says, whoever comes to me and hears my sayings and does them, I will show you whom he is like. He is like a man building a house who dug deep and laid the foundation on the rock. And when the flood arose, the stream beat vehemently against that house and could not shake it, for it was founded on the rock. But he who heard and did nothing is like a man who, who built a house on the earth without a foundation, against which the stream beat vehemently, and immediately it fell, and the ruin of that house was great." Since each of us is given the opportunity to build our life on earthly things or heavenly things, the temporary or the eternal, we must choose wisely. To not choose the eternal means we choose the temporary, the natural order, which is subject to decay and corruption. The scriptures here incited give us the understanding that God has given his son so that we might have eternal life. Again, we say that there is no other foundation that can sustain us except Jesus Christ. For all things depend on him. Without him, everything fails. He is the only true foundation on which we must build our lives. He is God's absolute essential for salvation, life with God. Let us choose him, Pastor Don.